it, it shocked me, you feel me? I mean, I ain't never did nothing to him. I fool and think I was, you know what I'm saying, go to that shoe. And I wasn't nowhere around that day. When I get to my granny, my granny house on 11th Street, they just stopped to pick me up. And um, had, had you met him before or anything like that? I don't know, I used, to give, I used to give him the cans and stuff so he could take the hands up of money. Nobody, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it shocked me for him picking me up like that. When they said <coughs> they were charging you with his murder, what ran through your mind? I told them they can't do that. And they told me, yes, we can. That was it. And how long were you in jail because of that? Uh, I think three or four days. Um, how surprised are you that they've signed off and dismissed that case? I'm happy. I don't want to be here with no murder charge. If nothing that I ain't do, really. Now, if you're back in here because of this Friday uh, incident, they say that you uh, shot uh, at this guy, Mr. Bowman. Do you have any idea who he is? Mm, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I had I had like where it happened at, right? I had just left, man. I had just left. I went in there, I went in the down low. You know what I'm saying? I shook both of the both of the kids' hands. And I, I had left. And ten minutes later, my man called me and told me it was a shoot. And I went nowhere around at the time the shooting was going on. They've said a lot of shootings have happened there on mm -hmm. that section of town. Um, we've seen that in the reports. What do you think? Why is that happening? Is there gang activity in that area? I don't know anything about that. All I know is my name keep getting brought up. <clears throat> and I believe my name is being brought up again because the recent time they, they labeled my name and I'm a bad person and I'm not. You involved in any gang activity? No, sir. Have you ever been? No, sir. Um, do you think there's gang activity? I mean, it's probably a lot of gang activity going on in Columbia. But I ain't no part of it. Do you, um, do you own a gun? No. Um, are you frustrated with the, the police and the, the investigators for your name constantly coming up? Yes, I am. Tell me about that. I don't know why you keep coming up. That's, that's what I'm saying. <clears throat> I believe this first incident is what got my name out there like I'm just some bad person. When you can have anybody in my neighborhood, man, I always got a smile on my face. Um, what do you say to those people who will be out there in the public that, that say, well, he was charged with that first crime. Um, you know, he must have had something to do with it, even if he didn't pull the trigger. Um, what do you tell them? That my name is clear now. And I had nothing to do with it. How unfair is it? Um, it's not really unfair. I mean, like, when I was out, <clears throat> they still had on Channel 4 that I was still locked up. They said it was, they had one suspect in custody. When I was when I was out there watching the news myself, I ain't like that at all. I really want a public apology. But you admit that you were at that specific location on Friday when the shooting happened. But no, you, I had left. But you you I were there you were there beforehand. Yeah. What were you doing there? Just chilling. Just walk like like we pulled up, went down there, got some got a drink, and I left. Like 10 minutes before, 10 or 15. And I had nothing to do with what went on that night. Anything else you'd like? Well, I guess, uh, do, do you know who did shoot Real, the real in Stovall? Uh, I don't know anything. Don't know anything. Uh, you said you were at your grandma's house that night? That night? That he was shot? No, no. Where, where were you at? The what? Where, where were you when he was shot? I mean, like which, which one? The Reeland, Reeland Stovall. 
Uh, I was way in Clearview. Clearview. I don't know where I am that day. <clears throat> That's why it shocked me when I got there and they pulled up there and charged me with it. I mean, I don't know if they're not doing their job or what, but something needs to give down there, man. And, and uh, why, why do you believe you were charged with Reland's death? It's just he say, she say. How many times have you been arrested and been in jail before? Um, not too many. Probably about three, four. What were they for? Uh, what was that for? Uh, nothing, nothing serious. Nothing serious. It's all petty stuff, really. Do, do you feel your $2 million bond is unfair? It's very unfair. And then, told me today that they have me in the paper as being a threat to society and I don't feel like I, my name should be labeled like that. That's messing me over jobs and everything. You know? I got a life too. Do, do you know if uh, Sunday's triple shooting, do you know if that's related to the Bowman shooting or the Reeland Stovall shooting? There are three people shot um, Sunday night. Yeah. Uh, Christopher Angus, I don't know if you know him. Cornell Lane and Quentin Mostella. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 I know him. Okay. Um, I mean, do, do, you, do you have a job or do, were you working? I was looking for one at the time. I believe I, I was finna get hired at that school before I get charged with all this stuff. It messed up. Um, so you said you're not you're not involved in the gang. Have no. never been. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you live in that general? How far do you live from where we in shooting was? Uh, walking distance. Okay. Yeah. Uh, do you feel like it's become an unsafe area? Like, if they were labeling you like that, you think your people would look at you the same? 